Hell yeah. Rocking Jimmy Neutron Black Style. Awesome. I love it. <sighs> Happy New Year. Hey guys, welcome back to another Eppin' Up Fridays, and if I didn't say it to you before, I'll say it to you now. Happy New Year's. Welcome to 2016. It's finally here. I'm glad 2016 is here because 2015 sucked ass. But let's hope for better things in 2016. And be it 2016, we all know what that means. There's going to be a whole bunch of talk of New Year, New Me bullshit. And that's all I feel about it. It is bullshit. But let me tell you why. New Year, New Me is absolute bullshit because everybody knows they're going to be the exact same as they were in 2015. As they said they were going to be different in 2014. That's still the same as how they were in 2004. So to me, you're going to be the exact same person as you was, as you've always been. So don't lie to me and bullshit me and like, oh, I'll be different now. No, you will not be different. You'll be the same. And if you want me to believe that you're going to be different, you got to prove me wrong all the way up to September. September, I'll start believing you're going to be different and everything. The only other part of New Year's that I don't like is all the resolution talk. Because be it the same thing as New Year, New Me. It's going to be the same bullshit that you're not going to do that you're going to talk yourself up about doing and then look terrible to everybody because you're not doing it. Like, oh, I'm going to go to the gym and lose some weight. No. You're going to start out for like four days and it's going to go every other day to every three days to once a week to once every two weeks to... Shit, I'm still paying for the gym. I've not been there in like eight months. So, no, you're gonna still be the same. Uh, I'm gonna wake up early. No, you're gonna hit the snooze button come three weeks from now, 17 times more than you did last year. Oh, uh, I'm gonna eat healthier, diet, stop drinking, stop smoking, all that shit. Good luck with that one. I'm not even gonna touch that one. Oh, I'm going to get good grades and be great in school this year. No, you're going to be a frat boy or a sorority girl, and you're just going to you gonna get torn up all day. And that diet's going to go out the window. The no smoking's going to go out the window. The no drinking's going to go out the window. And then we're back to square one. But let me not be a naysayer about... Um, having goals and dreams. You have high hopes to start off the year and everything, and that's great. But it shouldn't take a new year for you to be a better and new you. Treat every day like it's New Year's. Because there's never, there's never not an opportunity for you to always try and better yourself and become who you want to be. Don't let anything hold you back like that. And look at I have goals that I want to get done in 2016, but the thing is, I'm not going to talk about them because I don't want to set myself up for failure. I don't want to talk about my goals to everybody and then and then just end up with a certain look to people if I fall short. A good quote I learned at the end of 2015 is to sell yourself short, but then exceed expectations. The less people that know about everything you're trying to do equals the better you come out looking when you finally succeed in everything that you want to accomplish. So, please, have goals. If you want to lose weight, lose that weight. If you want to go to the gym, go to the gym. If you want to be a better student, do that. If you want to find somebody in 2016, there's plenty of fish out there. There's people everywhere. You might just find a new boo. If you want to get a promotion, do what you got to do to get that promotion. Figure out the little steps that it takes for you to get to what you want to get to. If it takes 60 days to get somewhere, what do you got to do in 30 to get to that 60? 
What do you got to do in 15 days to get to that 30? What do you got to do today to get to that 15? Is everything hinges upon you. You are the key to your success, nothing else. Don't let anything hold you back. And please, don't come to me with the new year, new me bullshit. Like I said, September, and then I might believe some shit. Happy New Year's, guys. Hey, guys, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video, and be sure to check out last week's video, and be sure to give me a like, share, and subscribe. And tell your friends to follow, too. Later, y'all.